Hello Pokemon fans, and it looks like this is a double battle, and there's three, half his team is legendary. And, yeah. Versus, not a bad setup. I've never seen uh, that dragon used very much. Or clayed also. Whatever, let's just get this started, and let's see where it goes. Now, wonder what he's actually going to do. He's probably got the Mewtwo Y. Probably going to start out with that is what I'd guess. And Lickitung that's shiny. Oh, Licky Licky. Can you say explosion? But there's a Psychic. Does very little. Again, knockoff would be amazing right now. I wonder why he's not Mega Evolving. Mewtwo would be the best Pokemon he would have to Mega Evolve, so... Huh. There goes the Trick Room. So his team's gonna start going first. Will-O-Wisp on the Licky Licky. And... Power Whip should actually kill. Nope, didn't go for the kill. Rye Emperor is going for the Mega Horn, which is going to take out Mewtwo. Gotta love Mega Horn. Bug type. Annihilate Psychics. How much Pokemon can learn it? Alright, Licky Licky. Zapdos is coming in. And we're going to probably. I, think, I see him definitely burning Zapdos to get that residual damage off. I wouldn't do that with Licky Licky just because Explosion is a real thing. It protects with other Pokemon, explodes when it gets low. Just too much of a risk of that happening. Stab Explosion is bad. Even with the Explosion nerf, I mean. So, more residual damage, and he lost his Rye Emperor. And... Here's the Pokemon I actually... Let's see. I haven't actually seen this one used very often. Gets the burn on Zapdos. Rock Climb. Does a decent amount. And we got the Power Whip. And Dustlops doesn't have much left. Maybe a nice pain slip, uh, pain split right now would be good. The saying, pain split now, eh? Licky Licky goes down. In comes the Blastoid, and those are his last two. Oh well, wait, I think it's six on six. So, okay, he goes for the Resto Chesto. No, he doesn't. It's Resto. Just gonna rest up and get back to pull. And he goes for the Blastoid. Half damage, not bad. Water Gun, not gonna do much, about 10 damage. Thunderbolt on the Dragon, not horrible. Alright, time to wake up. Time to wake up. Heat wave. Definitely heat proof on that guy. Oi. Decent amount of damage to everyone. Looks like he's still gonna stay asleep. He's gonna take some burn damage. And this turn he should wake up. I can see him waking up this turn. Alright, fly. Water gun's gonna do a little bit. I don't know why he didn't surf again, so he could damage them both. Trick Rim. So that means Zapdos is going to go last. Void wakes up. Gets his Will-O-Wisp off. Gets a little bit of that residual damage off. Can't complain about that. And he goes for the rest. And is he Resto Chesto? Come on, Resto Chesto. 
No Resto Chesto. Okay. Rocky Helmet, gonna take some burn damage. Fly is gonna hit, not deal much. I don't know, that slightly bugs me that he's running Fly on his Zapdos. Hmm. Infestation, so there's no escape. So Zapdos is basically done next turn. And Blastoise is gonna be not lasting very much longer either. Yeah, Zapdos is done this turn now because of that. Heat Wave. And I can see the rest coming up again if he doesn't feel comfortable at this level. Alright, that's down. Zapdos. That Blastoise is going to be a little bit of a pain though. Evil Tall. Can you feel the drain today? Oh. Will the Wisp on it to get some res res residual, residual damage. And he's still asleep. Wanna buy Resto Chesto here? Eh. Yeah, you might want to rest before you lose that Pokemon. Blasto goes down to burn. Tall takes some burn damage. Dragonite comes in. Extreme speed doesn't. What? What? Okay, whatever. That was definitely misplayed. Just so you know, ghost types cannot be affected by normal types. I know it's outrageous, but that's how it is. All he has to do is survive up on all this and Rocky Helm is going to deal some more burn damage not bad and it looks like there's a forfeit oh hope you guys enjoyed the battle and hope everything's everyone has a good day